Boat just released their new Boat Rockers 335 neck band earphones. You knew. I'll make a video. So here it is. Let's discuss all the things like battery life features, sound quality and everything you need to know before making this purchasing decision. Hey, what's up? My name is Shivam and before getting to the video, if you want to find the best deals on this earphone, you can head to the first link down below in the description. So recently Bort launched their new Rockers 335. I wanted to see it for myself, how good they sound. So here we are today. Before diving further, let's do a quick unboxing to see what can we expect from the box. So here is the shipping package. As you can see, it is not pretty looking. Let's pop this thing and take out our retail packaging. Yes, now we are talking business. Here is the retail packaging and as you can see, here it lists some of the features of these earphones. That is the support for the Qualcomm APTX and the APTX HD and CVC noise cancellation mic is also there. Now here is an image of the earphones itself, how they are supposed to look. Now on both sides it says port and heading to the back we have a lot of features like Bluetooth 5.0, Type-C port, ASAP charging and a lot more. We are going to discuss these features in the later part of this video. So we should stop wasting our time reading that here. Instead let's take the earphones out and see what they look like. So here are the earphones itself. We don't need this now, looking good. Let's see what else is in here. A small packet containing all the accessories, some extra ear tips, USB-C cable and some documentation. Okay, so that was a quick unboxing and now let's test this thing out and see how it performs. Design and build quality. So first of all, let's talk about the design and build quality. For that, I want to say that the Bot Rock S335 is a good ear designed earphones. We have this part of the earphones and the earbuds itself in the metal and everything else is either in plastic or rubber. The whole device is good, but the buttons are a little bit flimsy and hard to press. And I'm damn sure this flap on the charging port is going to come out in one to two weeks. On the weight side, these are 30 grams, which is quite lightweight and it doesn't feel like you are carrying something on your neck. Even though both have some metal part in terms of build quality, I don't have a good feeling that they will last long. Both makes some good earphones, but they always have complaints about the build quality of the product. So I can't say about the life of this. Comfort and fitting. This is an important part when picking any headphones or earphones because you don't want to buy something that is uncomfortable or doesn't securely fit into your ears. So in that aspect, good thing is that Rokus 335 are pretty comfortable. I can easily wear them all day long without any sort of pain. On the fitting side, they are amazing as there are these ear hooks on the earphones. They stay glued to your ears and you can easily take them with you in your workout or running sessions. Features. On the features side, there is a lot going on. An year ago, you couldn't imagine all these features at this price range but time has changed a lot now we get tons of features on this neck band earphone for the connectivity we have bluetooth 5.0 on the device although it doesn't say on the box that it has fast pairing but it only took me four to five seconds to connect to my phone which is pretty quick i think next we get magnetic earbuds but the thing that is missing here is auto turn on and off when you connect or disconnect the two magnetic earbuds this is pretty common feature nowadays in these neck band earphones but it is missing here. One exclusive feature could be found on the Rokus 335 is the integration of the Qualcomm chip. The model is missing on the internet. However, this gives us Qualcomm APTX and APTX HD support. So there would be some noticeable sound improvement. We will test the sound quality for ourselves in a minute. But now the next feature we have is the dual pairing. This feature can be used to connect two devices simultaneously. For example, you have your phone and laptop connected. Now, if you will be watching videos on your laptop and suddenly you get a call on your phone then the media will automatically pause and the audio will start coming out of the smartphone now for making this device charge faster we have asap charging on the board if you set this to charge for 10 minutes you will get 10 hours of playtime we will talk more about charging and playtime in a bit but to make things durable we have ipx rating as well here we have ipx5 that means the earphones can withstand sweat and water splashes last but not the least we have low latency mode this is very useful feature for all the games 
game is out there. Although a true gamer will always choose wired connection instead of Bluetooth. But for casual gamers, we have this feature to help. So while I was testing the low latency mode, I got these results. Now there are inline buttons provided on 335 which can be used to adjust the volume, voice assistant, play pause track and to take calls. And speaking of the calls, a feature that we get here is the CVC noise cancellation mic which means this should block outdoor noises while taking calls. But here is a quick test of the inline mic so you can judge by yourself. This is the test of the inline mic of the Boat Rockets 335. So this is what the person you are talking to would hear your voice. Battery life. When it comes to the battery life on the rockers, we get 150 milliamp hour battery, which can be charged in 40 minutes. And after that, you are supposed to get around 30 hours of playback. And in my testing, I got around 28 hours of battery backup, which is insane. For me, I would charge this once in three days. So for anyone for whom battery is a major concern in the neck band earphones, they should definitely go with the rockers 335. Here comes the crucial part of any audio device, which is the sound quality. So for the sound quality, both Rockers 335 has 10 mm of driver which produces great sound just like any other boat earphones which are known for their boosted bass this one does have excellent bass response better than all i mean if you're the guy who loves the bass then you are going to fall in love with this one it's clean it's smooth every 808 glide bass guitar you will hear every single detail now for the other frequencies i will say they are not very present but listening to the genres like hip-hop rap or any other bass heavy genre sounds fantastic and comparing this with the Drocus 255 for a second 335 has better bass response 255 has some mud in that but this one is smooth and clean cherry on the top is the support for the aptx and aptx HD and for the loudness I would say that they are very loud anyone complaining about the loudness of this would be either deaf or have some shit ton of wax in his ears for me 50% of the volume is more than enough now if you don't like the boosted bass and you want to listen to mixed variety of genres like me then Oppo M31 OnePlus Bullets Wireless C or the Realme Buds Wireless would be a better choice review is right up there now coming down to the price they are priced at 2000 rupees which is decent for any neckband earphone and sometimes you can even get some lightning deals on this so make sure you check out the first link down below in the description and for the price these are one of the best neckband earphones that you can pick right now if you're looking for a neckband earphone with amazing battery life tons of features and to enjoy some bass heavy songs then you should definitely go with the 335 so that was today's video by the way if you want me to compare these earphones with other earphones then please let me know in the comments down below and that's been it guys that was my review hope you guys liked this video and if you did just click the like button below share this video with your friends and subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet until then stay safe bye bye